The idea of the meeting between the three men was one of the recommendations of the political dialogue between the government and the opposition earlier this year to calm the political temperature in Cote d'Ivoire. The country has experienced several political crises in recent years involving these three men who have been at the forefront of the political scene for decades. In 2010, the presidential duel between Laurent Gbagbo and Alassane Ouattara led to a post-election crisis that left some 3,000 people dead and led to Gbagbo's arrest in April 2011. In 2020, electoral violence during the presidential elections left 85 people dead and 500 injured. The election boycotted by Mr. Bedi saw the re-election of President Alassane Ouattara for a third controversial term deemed unconstitutional by the opposition. The last meeting of the Big Three, as some call them, was more than 10 years ago. It was before the first round of the 2010 presidential elections. A Gambian court has sentenced five former members of the intelligence service to death for the murder of a political activist during the rule of ex-dictator Yaha Yami. High Court Justice Kumba Sila Kamara pronounced the sentence against the former head of the National Intelligence Agency, Yakumba Baji, after finding him guilty of murdering Ebrima Solo Sandeng, an important figure in the opposition United Democratic Party in 2016. The agency's former operations chief, Sheikh Omar Jeng, as well as NIA officials, Babuka Sala, Lamim Dabo, and Antamba Masari were convicted on the same charges and sentenced to death by Banjo Court. Sandeg was arrested during an April 2016 demonstration against Jambe. He died in custody two days later after having been beaten and tortured.